is now law. Tonight, I am signing a law to turn a page in Mississippi by retiring the flag that we have flown since 1894. This was a hard conversation for Mississippi, but family conversations can often be hard. Over the last several weeks, I have repeatedly heard it said that we must have change because the eyes of the nation were on Mississippi. Frankly, I'm not all that concerned about the eyes of the nation. I do care, however, about looking in the eyes of every one of my neighbors and making sure they know that their state recognizes the equal dignity and honor they possess as a child of the South, a child of Mississippi, and yes, as a child of an almighty God. The eyes I care about belong to my daughters, Tyler, Emma, and Maddie, and your children and grandchildren, and the eyes of all of our fellow Mississippians. This is not a political moment to me, but a solemn occasion to lead our Mississippi family to come together, to be reconciled, and to move on. We are resilient people defined by our hospitality. We are a people of great faith. Now more than ever, we must lean on that faith, put our divisions behind us, and unite for a greater good. I know there are people of goodwill who are not happy to see this flag change. They fear a chain reaction of events erasing our history, a history that is no doubt complicated and imperfect. I understand those concerns and am determined to protect Mississippi from that dangerous outcome. It is fashionable in some quarters to say our ancestors were all evil. I reject that notion. I also reject the elitist worldview that these United States are anything but the greatest nation in the history of mankind. I reject the mobs tearing down statues of our history, North and South, Union and Confederate, founding fathers and veterans. I reject the chaos and lawlessness, and I am proud it has not happened in our state. I also understand the need to commit the 1894 flag to history and find a banner that is a better emblem for all Mississippi. There is a difference between monuments and flags. A monument acknowledges and honors our past. A flag is a symbol of our present, of our people, and of our future. For those reasons, we need a new symbol.